Hey everybody, it is April 11th and you're here at the Chaos Weekly Community Call. So welcome everybody. Um, very light agenda today and a light group as well. So this will probably be a quick-ish meeting. Uh, let me share my screen here. Okay. If you want to add your name to the agenda and tell us if you would rather be in a comedy movie or a, an action movie, looks like we have a bunch of comedians here, not so much action. <laughs> action seems like a lot of work. I'm just going to say it. Like I'm saying Die Hard 6. I want the action and the comedy. <laughs> we, I, I took the kids to watch John Wick 4. And yeah, I was <laughs> not like, the little, not the little kids. <laughs> no, 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 no. My kids are grown. Yeah, they're they're older. Um, and I'm just like exhausted just watching that movie. If you haven't seen it, it's it's awesome. It's the John Wick films are fantastic and over the top. And I love Keanu Reeves anyway. So yeah, yeah. and he's it. he's like not a young guy. Like I'm, and he does all that is himself. I mean, I just I don't even understand. He's built different, I guess, because I do not understand that at all. He does a lot of that Zen stuff. Yeah, yeah, I dig it. Yeah. Um, okay, so let's jump in. Like I said, we have a really short agenda. Here are the four items. Um, if we do have folks, I don't even know if we'll have folks for the um, Chaos Con Planning Committee. We might not even need that 20 minutes, but we'll see how it goes. Um, uh, yeah, so a Mary Blessing was going to give an update on the tour guides, but I don't see her here yet. So we'll just hang on to that item right here. Uh, and, and if she doesn't come, I can give a, well, not really an update, but I can give an overview of what that program is about, just to let people know. Um, so we'll just move on until she comes. Um, if you're interested in becoming one of our DEI event badgers, so those are the folks that help review the applications for our DEI event badging. Um, if you're interested in that, we have a new badger orientation scheduled for tomorrow, and that's going to be at 9 a.m. or basically the second half of our regular badger meeting. Um, so if you are interested in that, let me know and I'll send you an invite um, and make sure you're on the list for that. Um, it's open. We, we do this periodically. So, um, you know, it's not that if you don't catch it this time, you can absolutely catch it again later. Um, but we are going to have that available tomorrow. Does anybody um, have questions on that? I'll, I'll just mention um, new to this meeting is uh, one of my PhD students, Rakib, who is working with us on some of the machine learning related to auger data and uh, project badging. So, um, just wanted to introduce a new member of the community. Welcome, so. Rakeem. Yeah, it's great to have you here. Hello. Hello. Hi. Thank you very much. Rakeem, are you based in Missouri as well, then? Uh, yes. Awesome. Well, feel free to um, reach out to any of us. Obviously, you know Sean, but if you do have other questions and Sean's not around for whatever reason, feel free to reach out to any of us, myself, or, um, you know, any anybody in the general or newcomers Slack channel, we're happy to help you find your way and answer any questions you might have, if we can. Okay. Thank you very much. I will. You are welcome. Um, sorry, any, were there any questions about the new Badger orientation? I don't, I mean, it's pretty straightforward, but if you do have questions, let me know. Fair enough. Um, the other thing I wanted to mention is I am super behind on update or uploading the meeting recordings to YouTube. I am so sorry, friends. I will be working on that today. So um, if you were looking for a meeting recording and you couldn't find it, it's not your fault. Totally my fault. <laughs> so um, I usually post them also in the appropriate Slack channels. Um, so if you're not subscribed to those playlists, just keep an eye out in the Slack channel and I'll, there'll be links to those recordings from the last few weeks of meetings. So my bad. Um, and then the only other thing on our agenda is Sean, you want to talk about the new Augur release? Hooray, hooray. Yeah, uh, just uh, we released another version of Augur last night that really makes it 
uh, fully capable of being a hosted solution, which is something that we're moving towards. Um, and we're working closely with the OSS Aspen 8 Knot project, which is a Dash Plotly uh, toolkit um, that uh, is going to be also released uh, more widely soon. So um, we're, we're just uh, excited about the, the growing instability and ability to do hosting um, that, that Augur provides. And so you'll be hearing more about that in the future. But um, yeah, it's, uh, it's very exciting. Any questions for Sean? I don't want to bore the group with a demo, so I will not do that. I actually have a question for you, Sean. Um, are there um, are there areas that you're looking for contributions in particular right now as the yeah. project kind of evolves? I don't know because we yeah. have new folks coming in. So, what in, are you looking in, for now? Yeah, in fact, um, we've. There's a number, we, we try to routinely create uh, issues um, using the first timers only tag. And we've had a couple of pull requests um, from people who are brand new um, to the project who've picked up that tag and done, done some work for us. And so if you're interested in Augur, one of the things the first timers only tag um, gets you is a lot of help from the maintainer team. Uh, so if you need to figure it out, and there are a couple of ones that are open right now, I really focused on the, the specialization area that we're developing. I can't remember what we're calling them around um, scientific open source software and also OSPOs um, and um, academic open source software for remembering the three bubbles correctly. So um, just some new data sources and some new new things that we're, we're looking for. and. Um, Trying to keep trying to keep those um, issues tight and labeled so that newcomer, you know, first timers can come around and give it a shot. And Sean, would you say those are mostly around um, writing code or technical documentation, or what would be like the skill set right. of folks? Yeah, right. Right now, they're around writing code, and, and the reason we use the first timers only tag is because we don't expect to some. I don't think. It's reasonable for an open source project to expect somebody to just come to the project and figure out how to add code. However, um, we've created these what I'd characterize as small problems that have a very small part of the code that they can work in and often have other examples of similar kinds of things. And that's where with these issues that are tagged for first timers only, we're, we're looking for these kinds of contributions. Um, I, I think updating documentation is always something that, that we're working on and if, if I don't have issues open for that right now but if if there are people who want to contribute to documentation uh, a few folks have made pull requests like precious I don't know if she's on the call today um, recently and, and um, we're always we're always we always welcome those kinds of contributions very much okay any other questions for Sean? Um, is there anything else we want to talk about? We have tons of time <laughs> today for, for whatever reason, we have a lot of time and nothing super pressing on the agenda. So are there topics that we want to chat about while we're here? If not, I mean, we can certainly close the meeting. I'm not going to make everyone hang out with me until, <laughs> until 10 till, but. Uh, I did, I did create the initial page for uh, ChaosCon Africa. Awesome. Uh, however, uh, we're waiting on information about that. So I, I, I suppose I would like to kind of make sure that someone is going to finish it. Or some, someone who has information or uh, I know they're like working to share on, information. Yeah, I think they're still working on a venue. And I think it's might be um, that might be holding up and also maybe sponsorship they're looking for to in order to secure the venue. So there might be some pieces that are falling in place, but yeah, I know that people are working on that. So as soon as they know, I'm sure they'll let you know. Okay. Kevin, I actually have a, a meeting with Ruth in a little while, so I'll just 
touch base with her on that too, just to make sure that there's no up- updates on that. Yeah, and she she does have WordPress access, by the way, so she could uh, she could put that info in if she wanted. I'm okay, more, I'm, I'm I'm more than happy to. I just uh, oh. I just want to make sure it doesn't fall through the cracks with uh, people thinking someone else is going to do it or. Yeah, no, that's great. That's perfect. So I am happy to in, do it. I just need information if I'm going to do it. Is it in draft form now? Yeah, the page is just a uh, draft. It hasn't been published yet. Okay, perfect. Yeah. So uh, actually, yeah, either she or I can update that. No big deal at all. Um, Don, are you looking for the agenda you mean right here? Yeah, We're actually okay. about Thank done. <laughs> Please. Joined at just the right time. Yeah. Uh, unless there's other pressing things. And and if we do have stuff to talk about for Chaos Con NA, um, planning stuff, we can certainly stick around for that. I don't personally have anything, and Matt's not here. So, yeah, I'm not sure. Whatever y'all want to do. Is there anything else um, for the community part of this meeting besides what's on here? I don't think Mary Blessing is quite here. So she can give us an update next time. No big deal at all. <laughs> Sophia likes the birds in the background. Yeah, I have the window open. Mm. It's beautiful. Kevin, I think, is sitting outside also with some chirpy birds in the background. Well, I have to say, I, I keep seeing in the notes and things and people keep talking about the badger orientation and I just think of like the animal because that's yeah. pretty common here in the UK. And so every time I say it's like badger orientation, it's like, oh, badgers. <laughs> but not. Yeah. Do you, have you ever gotten a picture of one? Have you seen one in person, Don, like running around? No, they're, they're a little more nocturnal, but we see badger holes all over the place. So we wow. see their, their little homes and you stay away from them because I, I hear they're not, not very nice. <laughs> That's they're okay. Bad. Yeah. They're tough. They don't care. But they're also protected. So you're not allowed to do anything if you have badger holes, um, but you see them in parks and stuff. The holes. Awesome. Well, if you ever get a picture of one, and you want us to post that in the repo, we will be happy to do that. Because <laughs> I think we just have like standard clip art everywhere. So, you know, if we had an actual real picture from someone in the chaos community, that would be amazing. We would totally post that. All right, I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> and, and to your point about this action movie sounds like hard work, that was exactly my take on it as well. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that just sounds like like running around and hundred percent. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Well, if we if we don't have anything else, um, are you all sure we don't have anything since we're here? Anything that's right. been on your minds? OK, fair enough. Uh, we just powered through that agenda and I uh, hope you enjoy the rest of your days and the rest of your meeting time. You get all this time back. <laughs> To do and the rest stuff. of your days as well. You know, live long and prosper. <laughs> yeah, right. Live long. Yes. Enjoy your days on the earth. Uh, okay. All right. Have a good one, everybody. And we'll see you here next time. Right. Take see care. See you next time. Bye, Bye everybody.